Not up yet, so I don't know how much you can see, but the trail is salted. Piece of lake front path is salted, at least for most of it. My first mile, I was running in snow. It snowed about four or five inches last night. But uh, the more interesting thing is, Lake Michigan is starting to freeze over. Once again. Looks like I hit the part, the lakefront path where they stopped icing or salting. It's really icy. Now this part of my run is normally pretty hilly, so I try to run as close to the lake as possible. But it's pretty icy up here, and I'm worried that the wrong step, and I might end up in the drink. At least it's starting to get lighter out, so I'll be able to see where I'm going at least. Again. Just a little over four miles into my run. Turning it around now. Update on the shoes. I'm at this part of the park where it's really slushy right now. And um, I can feel my feet kicking up slush onto the tops of the shoe, into my toes. Some even got up my leg and in my sock. But other than the part that got in through the sock, my feet feel great. My hands are colder than my feet are, which was the opposite before I got these. Nike Zoom Pegasus 33 Shield shoes, so I like these shoes a lot. Once again. and slush and snow but uh, inside my feet are warm by the last like two miles like starting from mile six or six and a half on my right toe started getting a little bit numb uh, I don't think that was because I was cold or wet I think it was because uh, it's new shoes and uh, the last pair of these shoes that I got that were the not uh, winterized version I had the same issue for like the first I don't know seven or eight runs where I was kind of like breaking in the shoe other than that, a good run. Towards the end, you know, at the beginning of the run, I felt like I was hot because it was only like 20, it was 20 something degrees out, which has been, it's balmy compared to what it's been like. But um, by the end, I, I think part of it is that it's supposed to get colder throughout the day. And I felt that a little bit. And also just after being outside for like over an hour, I think that uh, things start getting cold no matter how warm they might have originally been. So that's it for the run. Overall, really good. I mean, I've tested these shoes so far for wetness, distance, grip, uh, and they all do really, really well, exactly what I'm looking for, because I'm not looking for like an ultra marathoners trail running shoe. I'm looking for something that I can run in the winter and that I run mostly tarmac and hard packed gravel. Um, it just might get icy or wet uh, from time to time. So, so far it's perfect for what I want. So, Once again. I'll see you tomorrow. What's going on?